Hello and welcome to the second part of our series, Does my mobile phone have consciousness? The last time we talked about Lambda, about Blake Lemoyne and emergence. It was not really clear how that might work that emergence creates consciousness. And that's where we came to the conclusion that the questions were not answered. And first of all, we want to know where come the concept of artificial intelligence? Where was the first time that someone spoke about AI? It was here that visionary minds like John McCarthy, Marvin Minsky, Nathaniel Rochester and Claude Shannon organized a historic workshop in the summer of 1956. A workshop that marked the birth of a term that would forever change our world. Artificial intelligence. In a press release authored by these pioneers, the term artificial intelligence was introduced to the public for the first time. This groundbreaking moment was the beginning of a new chapter in human history. The significance of this moment cannot be overstated. The Dartmouth Workshop of 1956 laid the foundation for the exploration of machines that can learn, think and solve problems, qualities we deem as intelligent. This workshop was the starting point for the development of AI systems that now permeate our world. In AI research and development, the aim is to create machine thinking to solve complex problems and make the impossible possible. And all that began over half a century ago at a college in New Hampshire. The Dartmouth Workshop of 1956 was the birth of artificial intelligence and the source of an infinite wellspring of innovation. Today, AI is shaping our world in many fields, from medicine to entertainment, from transportation to the economy. As we can see, there's a long history. But now we have other questions like, what is AGI and what is singularity? Look this post, please. Artificial general intelligence, AGI, refers to a form of artificial intelligence capable of solving tasks and making decisions across a wide range of fields that typically require human intelligence. It represents, in a way, the realization of the singularity, a concept predicting a future in which machines surpass human intelligence and potentially even become self-improving. The period from 1990 to the present has played a significant role in the AGI discussion, and Ben Goetzel is undoubtedly a prominent figure in this domain. Over the past three decades, AGI research has seen substantial advancements. During this time, Ben Goetzel has played a central role in the discussion and development of AGI. While not the sole driving force, he is unquestionably one of the most prominent personalities in this field. Ben Goetzel has been actively involved in various projects aimed at realizing the dream of creating an AGI entity. In particular, he founded the company Novamente LLC in 2001, specializing in AGI technologies. This company has been deeply involved in researching and developing artificial intelligence at the highest level, contributing significantly to the AGI discussion. Furthermore, Ben Goetzel has brought an essential philosophical and ethical dimension to the AGI discussion. He has emphasized the necessity of not only pursuing technical advancements in AGI research, but also considering ethical and moral aspects. His work has contributed to deepening the debate on the societal impacts of AGI and highlighting the need for responsible AGI research. So now we know that there are researchers that explains that we will get singularity in some years, maybe in five years, maybe in 10 years, maybe in 20 years, but very soon. And there's the question, what is the dangerous about singularity? And we got the answer that there are systems that decides independently. We have autonomous systems. They decide without asking us, and this decision will have impact into your life. So we have still to discuss very important points, and please participate on this, and you can write something in the comments. Thank you very much.